really want to defend this title. We have three strong Chinese swimmers across the two heats. The world record and Paralympic records holders do in lane four is the Paralympic record holder. So we have Krosky, Castorina, Du, Vian Raditz and Fredrickson in the first heat of two. So the 150 metres individual medley for the SM3 classification means there is no butterfly leg at the beginning. So they start with backstroke, head into breaststroke and finish with a freestyle. And early on, it's been a Raditz who's off to a great start with the backstroke. We do know that he is a strong backstroke swimmer. So not a huge surprise, but uh, do will want to keep in check there. He won't want to drop off the pace too much. And five swimmers in each of the heats. So it's been an extremely busy past 48 hours for the SM3 classification swimmers. They're all bunched together and new events every day. So a very full program. Vina Raditz touching in in 46.50 and Du is just over three seconds off the pace as they're heading to their breaststroke leg and Castorina who was the silver medalist in Athens so he's now 38 just touching in trailing the field at the moment but it looks as though Du is managing to make up just a little bit of the pull on Vian Raditz who's a full body length in front at the moment and the pair are well in front of the rest of the field uh, Corsi from Thailand, you can see at the top of your screen. So he's swimming in lane two. He's just been overtaken by Castorina. And uh, Fredrickson also just staying in touch with the minor positions of this heat. But uh, the standings are going to remain the same at the second turn. Vinoradets hasn't managed to make up much of the pool on Du. Du just staying in touch at the moment. Well, Du is, uh, he'll be stronger in the first leg and the third leg here. He's a, a strong freestyler and backstroker, so he should fancy his chances of staying in that second place. Vinaritis, though, is a quality all-round swimmer and indeed does touch first a 156.77 uh, at the wall. Just outside two minutes for Du Jiangping of the People's Republic of China. Gustorina touches third fastest overall uh, at 2.10.81, so well off the pace at the moment, but does turn third in the pool. Fredrickson fourth and Kosri will uh, touch fifth. But uh, Vinrade is extending his advantage here and uh, Du holding on for second place, well ahead of Castorina. So Vinrade has had a fantastic freestyle leg. He's really stretched out, extended his lead so strong in the upper body. And he may well challenge the record here. It's going to be close. He might know he'll just fall a little short of that, but he's done enough to qualify as the winner of heat one of two and Du doing just what he needs to and as we've said an extremely busy schedule here touch in second so a time of 2.59.45 in a rut it's 2.46.04 and uh, next to touch in will be Castorina who made up a lot of ground on the breaststroke leg it must be said he had a, a strong breaststroke leg Fredrickson who's been so popular with the crowds here will touch in next from Sweden and the final swimmer who's going to receive a rousing applause from the Brazilian crowd is from Thailand, Sharkhorn Korsri is just completing his freestyle leg. And the Thai athlete touching in in fifth position and the crowd absolutely getting behind him when they saw he was trailing the rest of the field and giving him some support in the, part, in the last 25 metres. So the winner of heat one, 246.04, Dimitri Vinoraditz. And second position, Du Jianping. Who still holds the Paralympic record after that heat? 2:59.45 was his qualification time. And you can see Frederick there, just how strong he is under the water, getting into that rhythmic motion as he breaks water and 
got off to a good start, but it really was all about being a rat. It's such a strong all-round performer, as we mentioned. Do a little stronger in the first and third lengths of the pool. But managed to hold his own in the breaststroke leg. He actually dropped off more in the freestyle leg. I suspect was tiring just a little and knowing that he didn't need to push himself too much to ensure qualification into the final given the lineup of the rest of the field. So still five swimmers to come in heat two. And Bina Raditz there by the side of the pool. Now goes and has a few hours to rest and recuperate. He'll keep an eye on the lineup for heat two and see what sort of times Huang Wenpang is able to post. He set the world record, Huang, back in June this year in Berlin, and that doubles as his qualification time of 2.43.13. So the final So it appears there that Vinaraditz, despite winning the first heat, has been disqualified. We'll wait for further confirmation as to whether that is contested.